Did we do it? Did you save Ninjago? You failed because you did not have what it takes to win. We were chosen to save Ninjago, but you let us down. It's your fault for giving up the golden power. You became weak. How could you kill our own father, the man who cared for us? Well, when he was good, but still. Do you not remember what I said before you killed me? I remember you. I love you. How could you, Lloyd? How could you kill your own father? I am disappointed. I died destroying the staff of elders because of you. My death is all your fault. Deep down, you know I should have been the Green Ninja because I would have done what it took to defeat the darkness. You have disappointed us all, Lloyd. I did the best I could. I am the Green Ninja and I tried my best and yet you still failed and everyone is dead. I don't know why I ever loved you. You didn't have what it takes to save the woman you love. I understand what you're trying to do. You're trying to teach me a lesson, but I don't need it because I am not afraid. I know I failed, but please send me back. Give me another chance. For the past year, I've been trying to find the answer to a question. Oni or dragon, which side do I embrace? When I'm an Oni, I feel powerful and strong. But when I'm a dragon, I feel mighty and invincible. Well, the answer is Oni and dragon. To defeat the darkness, there must be balance. I understand. So Lloyd, are you ready? Hell yeah. I'm ready to go back, Grandfather. Yes, time is running out. Before that, we must tell him everything. Yes, it's time to tell you the truth. The truth about what? The Overlord, how he's been playing the long game. If you remember, when he was defeated by Yang, he was weak. He absorbed darkness from the Oni during the Oni invasion, but he still wasn't powerful enough to physically be seen by anyone or to hurt anyone. But he could affect their mind. He could give them thoughts and suggestions when they wouldn't be aware, which is why he discovered a man named Quinn, who was also discovered by a man named Xavier. One, unknowingly helped the Overlord return to power. I know what you're thinking, but the Queen you knew was your friend. Did you ever wonder why he suffered from blackout? Like the time he gave Xavier the idea to find the Staff of Elders. Yes, I remember that. He said he blacked out and he just thought about finding the Staff. So Quinn didn't betray us this whole time. He just wasn't aware. Yes, but now it gets worse. Remember? When Wu destroyed the staff, it created cracks throughout space and time from other realms to other dimensions. The Overlord did not intend it to happen, but he found a way. How? The crack between the departed realm was weak, which is why he needed some powerful allies to help him in his quest. Like when Derek found the Skull Sorcerer's existence in his father's journal, but he couldn't find Vangelis. It, it wasn't until he found a mysterious contact who had a map to the lost city of Shintaro. Can you guess who gave Derek the map? Let me guess the Overlord. Yes, he knew the Skull Sorcerer 
could be a powerful ally. But there is something else you need to know. When you died... I sent you back to Ninjago personally. With your memories intact. It was the Overlord who erased your memories. He wanted to create a clean slate, help turn you into the ultimate weapon. And he also is the one who helped Xavier find you, but ultimately he may have killed your father. But then the Overlord realized something. It's your memories that make you hate. Without a blank slate, you don't have anything to fear, to hate. The Omega, the one I saw in my mind, that was the Overlord, wasn't it? He wanted me to remember all the terrible things I did. He wanted to turn me evil. Yes, everything since Xavier, Vangelis, Kelma, Wadira, was all because of chain reaction he caused. But you've been through so much, you fought only Dragons, snake demons, gods, pre anonyms and even Jin. But you still always find a way to save the day. Which is why you cannot give up now. The window of opportunity is almost closed. But I am sending you back. If you are ready, Lloyd. Are you ready to try again? Yes. I am ready. Let's do this. No, f what the? Everyone, stop fighting now. Something. What's wrong? What is it? Someone has reversed time. And I know this because my time watch creates like a, a personal shield that stops me from being affected by the changes in the timeline. And we lost. Ninjago was destroyed. The girl is right. I remember what she says. The Overlord. He killed us all. What do you mean you remember? Jin. We are cosmic beings, so time doesn't really affect us, but the Overlord, he must be stopped. Uh, since when are you on our side? When I saw Ninjago fall, it made me remember when I saw my own world fall. I want to kill you all and conquer the world, but I was a hypocrite letting Ninjago fall, because I know the pain. I know the pain of watching your world fall. So now, you want to help us get revenge? Yes. I may still be evil, but I will not let any more worlds fall. The Overlord must pay for what he did. He must pay for betraying us. So I call for a temporary truce. I may have done some terrible things, but I still have morals. And that makes me a better being than the Overlord ever will be. I respect you for that, Nanakan. But how are we going to defeat the Overlord? Well, my mother did always say I was very stubborn. You fell once! How is this time any different? That is a good question. I failed because I went in alone. Lloyd, he calls us. It is time. Hey, 
is finally ready. I was a fool to think I could fight you alone, and that was my downfall. But this time, I won't fail, because I have them. The ninja can't do this all alone. Then perhaps we should assist them. Do you want to know the biggest difference between you and me? You may have an army, some followers, but they serve you for their own self-interest and out of fear. But me, I have friends, people who love me. I have family, and that is the strongest weapon I have. You were built for destruction, so you don't know what it's like to not be alone. Because I am not alone. This ends now. I am ready. We do this together! Omni or dragon, light or darkness? How about both? Balance! You're still scared! Your fear is what makes you weak! <laughs> I promise you're still scared! Your fear is what makes you weak! Guess the prophecy was wrong! Actually, you're the one who's wrong, villain! The prophecy wasn't just about Oni and Dragon accepting both, it was also about you need to be good and evil. We may be evil, but you're the worst of all. If we've learned one thing, is that the balance requires light and darkness. Even those who fell into the darkness can still find the light. You ruined my life, destroyed my village, hurt many people, and for that you will pay. Only united will you be defeated! Lloyd, before I send you back, I need to ask you a question. Why do you fight? Why do you choose to fight? Because I'm the chosen one, the green ninja. I was chosen, not because you were chosen. Prophecies just tell what could happen. They're not always what will happen. Why do you fight? Who do you fight for? Who do I fight for? I fight. For my friends, for my family, but most importantly, I fight. I fight for her. I 
am ready. This ends now. Burning Jargon! Whoa, that was trip Lloyd. It appears the power was too much for him to withstand. Withstand? What? What are you saying? Lloyd? It seems the energy was too much for his human body to withstand. We won, but Lloyd? Is dead? No, no, I just got him back. This. Oh, uh, guys? Huh? You will pay. Demon! This might be the end for me, but at least I take him down with me. Poetic. Yes, but Lloyd didn't die alone. You die with no one caring. You both know I always find the way back. Hello, my old friend. It sure has been a while. First midgets, you master. It's been a while. I came to say goodbye because there will be no more resurrections. I may have convinced the elders to strip your soul away. No departed realm for you. No spirit, which means no resurrections. So this is truly the end? You know... Sometimes I feel sorry for you because you were created as just a weapon for the army. You never had your own free will. You were nothing but an empty shell, an echo of the army. But now, you can finally rest. This war will never be over. There will always be those who embrace the darkness. There will never be peace. I am aware this war is for eternity. My legacy shall continue. Yes, there will always be others, but there will always be those who stand up to evil. Even after the ninja are gone, there will always be the next generation. They are the greatest heroes I could have ever asked for. The ninja? are my greatest creation and I am beyond proud of all of you because I know your legacy will live on for millennia because Ninja never quit. So long, Ninja.
barely got time to catch up. You guys really have to go. Uh, it's been nice seeing you, kid, but we're dead, so we belong in the departed realm. <laughs> I hope you know we'll miss you guys. You know, we sacrificed our lives for Ninjago, so please don't turn Ninjago into hell again. What he's saying is goodbye, and we will miss you all. Wait! Not yet! I can sense it. I know it's you. Please, let me say goodbye. I could never hide from you. You could always sense me. Kronos, you're, you're still alive? But how? We recruited Kronos after his death. Just like how me and my brother was recruited, isn't that right? We cannot tell the future. We knew what was going to happen because we were there. We lived it. You lived it? Hmm. Does that mean that we know who you were? Me and my sister were once alive. And perhaps you did know us. But that is something to find out later. stuff want to dance oh I like a woman who stands up for herself so is that a yes best gift ever I'm gonna name another con the panda saying I think we're out of ice oh, again Very funny, punk. There you are, honey. Since when do you want to mess out on a pop? What's that? <laughs> Lloyd's Mac, we were going to give it to him for Christmas. <sighs> I miss him. This is more than just about Lloyd. Isn't it, Kai? It's just... It's been wonderful being with you again. I love you and I want to spend the rest of my life with you. What? That's, that's not a marriage proposal, just... We have our own... Worlds. You're in the future, time traveling, trying to protect the timeline while I'm back here. I just... I feel like we never just get to be... Kai... And Skylar. You know, I just spoke to Samantha. And she said you have at least the next year off. She said that you could come with me. Come on, why don't you come with me? Time travel adventures with Kai and Skylar. What do you say? You mean I get to go and be a pirate? Um, yes, and you get to be with the woman you love. So, what do you say? I thought... I was destined to save Ninjago, but I guess I was not. What was the point of all of this? Point of all my work? What am I supposed to do now? Did you forget about the Ninjago Protection Agency? You have all these smart genius people, all these people to help you. You can still do great things by helping people who are not trying to create superhumans trying to save the world. Be a man people can look up to. Maybe that's why I sent you on this quest. Perhaps you still have good things to do. Maybe. Hey, sweetheart. How are you? Oh, I, I'm leaving. Just can't do this. But there's someone who wants to talk to you. If they didn't convince me to stay, it's not going to work. It's, just, it's not the same without me, and now that the Overlord is defeated. For God's sake, Jay, just...
turn around. Ah, uh, what? Uh, Kronos, I know you're watching. I need you. Hello, La. I know what you want to do, but are you sure you want to do this? And why? When I saw Jay, he reminded me when I lost my wife. My son, who has inherited my powers, hated me. But if I can help Jay by switching places with Nia, creating balance, then perhaps Jay can finally be happy and I can save the life of my descendant. okay. Everything's going to be okay, Jay. I am back and I will never leave you again. Hello? Audrey? News back and now you're leaving, Kai. You should go, Kai. But I just got you back. I made a promise to you. Kai, I'm telling you to go with her. We all have our own journey to go on, but one thing will always remain the same. We are family, and when needed, I will be there for you. I love you guys. You showed me the light. I am today without any of you and for that I am eternally grateful as a family we can overcome anything that comes our way together till the end so is this party invite only or can anyone join father but you're you're dead have you here the elders they sent me back Apparently, running and killing me was not supposed to happen. Apparently, I still have a lot of work to do, so they sent me back. But Kronos wanted me to give you a gift. He couldn't get a real good gift, but he gave me... He gave me this. The Heart of Gem. This is his way of saying goodbye. Whoa, oh my god, Clancy, we're, we're mortal again, thank you. <gasps> Why are we here, Audrey? What did you want to tell me? Well, 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 if it isn't the new mayor, what do we owe the honor? We have a problem. The new chief of police has reopened up your case from nine months ago. You guys are in trouble. What case? What did I miss? Audrey, why are we here? What did you want to tell me? Actually, I'm not here to tell you anything. He is. Hello, it is me, Lloyd Garmadon, the Green Ninja. If you're watching this, then it means I am dead. This is a pre-recorded message. I am sending this to everyone in Ninjago, so everyone can see and everyone can know the truth. You all know I went through a dark place. I almost destroyed Ninjago, but it got worse. The Ninja... 
They didn't kill anyone. They didn't rob anyone. That was all me. I used my only shape-shifting abilities to frame them. Why? Because I was jealous of their happiness. I sent all the proof to the new mayor and I am sorry. I have failed you, but I'm, I'm doing this and mean the truth because I know I've made a mistake. And you need the ninja to protect you. That is why I, Lloyd Montgomery Garmadon, admit to framing the ninja and all of those crimes. And to my friends, goodbye. I hope you have a wonderful life. You deserve it. How? Why? Before we go, Lloyd, we have a suggestion to help one of your problems. Three, two, one, go. Hello, it is me, Lloyd Garmadon, the Green Ninja. If you're watching this, then it means I am dead. This is a pre-recorded message. You, you did it, Lloyd. We, we actually won. Why aren't you celebrating? Because we still have one last thing to take care of. My death. The elders sent me back after I died, so they could see my other corpse. I'm sorry I had to deceive you, but what about you? What about your life? <laughs> I thought you'd be happy. You t once told me, Saku, that you just wanted me to be normal, to have a normal life. You remember that? But you're only three. <laughs> it's my earliest memory. It, I always remembered. But now, I can finally live a normal life because the story of the Green Ninja is over. I can finally live my life with a woman I love. But what about Ninjago? <laughs> the ninja can handle this. That's why I framed myself. Because this world needed the ninja. I am really sorry for deceiving you, but I needed to say goodbye. I didn't do this for me, I did this for the ninja, so they can live their life, they can be together with the ones they love, not in a prison cell all alone, because my story may be over, but I believe theirs is just beginning, they have their own adventures to go on. I will miss my friends dearly, but they will move on. They will, but I believe eventually they will find new friends because we're a family and we're a family who always accepts new people, who always offers the chance of a lifetime to never be alone, to always have an opportunity to do good. This may be the end of my story, but there's still others out there whose adventure, whose journey is just beginning. When one chapter closes, another one opens. Before you go, I just have one more question, Lloyd. Will I ever get to see my son again? Lloyd, it's time to go.
filled as my heart is pierced. Oh, my soul is now exposed in the oceans deep, in the canyons steep, walls of All my desperate calls echo off the walls Back and forth, then back again To believe I walk alone Heart hold fast for this soon shall pass like the high tide takes the sand We are being hacked? Impossible. Why? Hello there, Agent Bennett. Who are you, hacker? And what do you want? The name's Trinity. I am looking for Utopia. It is done, my Empress. <laughs> <laughs>